I've just received the email about whether I've gotten the job as commissioner. Well, from the look on my face, I'm sure you can guess what it says. No! We have no idea at all! Just tell us, you monster! Really? No one noticed the slight tension in my labial commissioner? My lips, I'm smiling! It should take 70 seconds for you to fully gauge someone's character. Here's what to look for. Grammar, posture, scent, attire, level of perspiration, type of shirt color. When people say good morning, they mean hello. When people say how are you, they mean hello. When people say what's up, they mean I am a person not worth talking to. Are you still upset? No, not at all. You should consider modifying your handshake. It's sending the wrong message. Copy that. Each round will be individually scored by our judge, Captain Holt. Do you need to hear my credentials? Debate moderator license, D is in Delta, 810. I believe Or Y is in Yankee, 41, J is in Juliet, J is in Juliet, 6. I have a CompStat presentation coming up, and I was toying with the idea of using hand gestures for emphasis. Damn, sir, you took that Charbonnet to the house. How you feeling? Let me take stock. My equilibrium is askew, my vision is partially impaired, and I'm clearly slurring my words. To put a fine point on it, your boy is turned. No, study after study has shown that soliciting anonymous tips results in false leads and wrongful convictions. Hmm, tell me how you really feel. I did. Drum roll, please. That's your drum roll? When a tempo isn't specified, any reasonable person would default to lento. Welcome to sensual food tasting, the art of feeding your lover. I feel like I don't belong here. If I die, will you look after my cat? I'm really more of a dog person. GP40 diesel locomotive with sprung drive wheels, rule 17 lighting, and full underbody detailing. You're gonna be the belle of the ball. Before we begin, what are the parameters of the guessing game? How many guesses do I get? Is there a time limit? Forget it, you ruin everything. It's the police code and ethics manual, chapter four, page 83. You should not have told me. I never would have guessed it. Now, I won. Raymond Holt. Whoa, no, germs. Detective Peralta, this is my mother, the Honorable Laverne Holt. I'm very excited to meet you. And let me just say, I'm a huge fan of your early work. I'm talking about this guy right here. That was humor, Mother. I know, and I thoroughly enjoyed it. I love laughing and laughter. Oh. Yes, we all do, but enough chit-chat. His lips are slightly pursed, and he's blinking at eight-second intervals as opposed to his normal ten. <gasps> oh, my God. He's having a meltdown. Meltdown seems excessive. No, it's a meltdown. Mark my words. Right. Hey there, Captain. Everything okay? No, I'm having a meltdown. Rob, sounds amazing. Thanks, it was a lot of work. Ah, Boyle, there you are. I have a question for you. Daddy, wait up! Oh, your non-adult is at our place of work. We did it. It's over. Yes, I agree. Up, down, separation. This is one of several designated areas where you can stand upright during the day. You can move about freely in the square. Wow, so we have all this room to work in. Your hand can be seen from the living room window. You just killed Kevin. Raymond. I can't hear you, Kevin, you're dead. He bled out in your lap. How will you break the news to me? Let's see. We don't have to do this. Ah, Detective Peralta, how are things going with Kevin, the love of my life? Wait. Why are you here at this late hour? And whose blood is that? Okay, I guess. It's get Kevin's? It. This is devastating. I'm inconsolable. And I've killed myself. I only have one dream a year, always on tax day. In it, I must file an extension. So, yes, it is best not to have dreams. Oop, they're looking at us. Act natural. Spreadsheet, spreadsheet. Crime. Crime. Precinct, precinct. <laughs> You want me to spill the beans? Why would you ever intentionally spill beans? They're one of nature's most densely packed protein sources, and they remain unsullied by flavor. Ooh, are they testing the emergency broadcasting system? What? Lieutenant, as you know, I've been walking the same beat for the past three weeks. It's become a bit tedious. I thought you loved tedium. I love monotony. They're very different. One mistake did not make you the cop you are today. 30 years of service to the community did. That should be your motivation. I know you can't remember their names, but... Alex Chen. I do remember him. 36-year-old male, carjacked at the corner of 7th Avenue and 11th Street, had three siblings, Alice, Arlene, and Anna. Captain, I know you don't eat pizza, but I figured you'd want to be included. Uh, thank you. I read an article in the medical journal that said one destabilizing aspect of the incarceration is the constant dehumanization, Rosa. You need to be reminded that you're more than just a number, Rosa. You are Rosa. Rosa? Yep, that fixes prisons. 
I'd categorize that as an understatement. Humor. Yes, to alleviate some of the tension. It worked. You know what? There is no pleasing you. That is accurate. But now I'm just supposed to do anything that Rosa does? I mean, what if she jumped off a cliff? If Rosa were to jump off a cliff, she would have done her due diligence regarding the height of the cliff, the depth of the water, and the angle of entry. So, yes, if you see Rosa jump off a cliff, by all means, jump off a cliff. Hello, Captain Raymond Holt. It is I, Sergeant Terrence Jeffords, your friend, but more importantly, your employee. I've never heard you speak like this, Sergeant. I like it. Each sentence so rife with information. Go on, please. Sorry again for tying you spread eagle on the bed. Apology not accepted. I can feel it here. Your stomach? No, my gut. Your gut or intestines is lower. You should point down here, closer to your pubis. I'm good. We go back to the old bathroom break schedule and we just drive at max speed. Captain, punch it. Punch it. Why are you not punching it? I'm not comfortable operating this vehicle at a speed greater than the prevailing road and traffic conditions. I'd like to talk to you about the new task force you're on the hiring committee for. The Special Tactical Operations and Auxiliary Strategic Response Citywide Emergency Investigative Unit for Emergency Operations. You know, I had a hand in naming it. And it's great, although you might want to try shortening it, maybe using a cool acronym. So the S-T-O-A-S-R-C-I-U-E-O. Oh, you're right, that is cool. Where were you between 1220 and 1255? You aren't seriously suggesting that I am the prank man. It does seem a little far-fetched, Jake. I mean, he did just use the phrase prank man. It's not far-fetched at all. Holt is not the joyless robot that he once was. Is this about the time I ate a burrito? I was pressured into it. Hey, Captain, Sarge, I have a case I want to discuss with you. You want to talk about work in the break room? It's highly unorthodox, but I suppose we can give it a try. Okay, so, I have a perp. I'm sorry, this is insane. Let's talk in my office. Much better. Good oranges. Nice and dry. Not at all ripe. I decide when the squatting is necessary. This was my choice. <gasps> this adorbs photo of Tiny Holt with a tiny bow tie holding a tiny toy. That was his first slide rule. He carried it with him all over preschool. And then I learned to do trigonometric functions in my head like a big boy. Let's continue with the investigation. Don't worry. I'm not listening to you. I'm just thinking about how this sea bass is cold but not as cold and cruel as the hands of fate that have thrust my entire life into darkness. I like this one that carries coal and rivets, the two main exports of our town. Would you like to transport some coal or rivets? I will not be using a loophole, Peralta. As always, I'll be using the main hole or no hole. I choose no hole. Where on Gina's mobile should I place this moonless Jupiter? I pity the child who lies beneath this solar system. Hello, I'm Captain Raymond Holt, and I can assure you this is not a fun office. Thank goodness. In that case, my interest is renewed. Here is my resume. Oh, I'm feeling this. Are you guys feeling this? Gordon, why don't you tell Captain Holt a little bit about yourself? Where to begin? I'm 174 centimeters tall. I can type 103 words per minute with an error rate of 1.6%. And I recently moved here from Philadelphia, which is the sixth most populous US city. I understand the city of Philadelphia is coterminous with Philadelphia County, making it the eighth largest metropolitan statistical area. Yeah, Philly's cool. How depressing. I never would have thought that typing an intricate sequence of numbers from memory would bring such sadness. Kevin, they're not coming. Yes, I know you've already started soaking the rice. Couldn't we just eat it ourselves? I understand you purchased four portions of rice. Yes, that's a great idea. We'll eat the extra rice for breakfast. I love you as well. Kevin and I went to a dinner party where we played the French parlor game, Charades. I had to act out Elvis Presley. He's dead now, so I portrayed him as such. Who called this tip in? It's impossible to say. They said the drugs are in the back of a bovine transport unit? Who calls it that? Everyone, that's what they're called. Yeah, if you're a robot, and you're the only robot I know, sir. Bovine transport unit, meat more. Z. Oh yes, he wrote back right away. It wasn't as graphic as I feared. He wrote, the number eight, equal sign, 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 capital D. Oh, I see what this is. I am shocked right now. And I am enraged. We are shocked and enraged. Yes, and we're all showing it. Hello, you've reached the office of Raymond Holt. I can come to the phone right now. Hey, sir, I'm just here at the hospital with Jake, and I think he could use some... Oversight? Agreed. From now on, I'm going to be 15% more forthcoming on personal details and 5% more physically affectionate. And I will adjust in kind while also implementing a 12% increase in impromptu communication. Oh, Raymond. For all to Santiago, you'll be happy to know that I did not erase the server. Oh, thank God. But sad to know that Knox caught on. And a 
is now holding me at gunpoint. Why not lead with that? We need a new plan. No, no, I have just a thing. It's gonna be too small again. You have to really- I'm gonna throw myself down the stairs. What? Ah! Oh, oh. There's something private that is fueling you. And when I find that private fuel, I will extract it to use as my private fuel in my private fuel tank. Then I will have a full tank of private fuel and you will have an empty tank of private... Rosa.